Hi everybody, Neil Kravitz here. I hope you're enjoying these daily clinical pearls. This clinical pearl comes from a question that I just received from a general dentist. It is, on a lower incisor extraction case, how do you decide which incisor to extract? Now there's a few reasons why we might select a specific tooth for extraction. Number one, of course, if it's periodontally compromised. If you have a tooth that's pushed out too far labially or blocked out lingually, we're gonna wanna extract that tooth. But we know that the upper midline will split one of the lower incisors at the end of treatment. So what I like to do, if there's not a tooth that's periodontally compromised, is I will take out the furthest lateral incisor or the other central incisor. For example, if the upper midline is splitting the lower right one, I will either take out the lower left one or the lower left two. And the decision between the lower left one and lower left two could be on positioning. But also if the lower left two is really large, I might not wanna take out such a big tooth. So I might favor the lower left one in that case. But if the maxillary midline is perfectly splitting a lower central incisor, I don't wanna alter that, that's perfect. I will take out the other central incisor or the adjacent lateral incisor. Let me know what you think about this pearl. Thank you guys so much for subscribing to this page. Thank you for supporting the JCO.